Hey guys, this is Carmack Cray from CarmackRemedia.com, and today we have another RTX quick photo edit, this time with Jeff Williams from the concert that happened this year at a uh, RTX. So, this photo turned out amazing. Actually, I'll show you the end product here real quick. And it's got a lot to it, but this is where it started. And this is one of those things where I was saying before, never give up on a photo too early. If it looks like it could be something awesome, then go right ahead. Even if it goes to an extreme that's not usually your edit style, try it out. So here's what I do with this one. Uh, as always, first autocorrect, bring up some contrast here. And about here is where I noticed something. There was this purple, this orange light. He was actually very well exposed in this setting. So I took it a little further, a little further. And now here's where I get to go a little crazy with this color. So you can see there's a lot of noise and grain in this image. I don't even care about that because I wanted to take this a little further. So I'm going to punch this here, punch the orange there, and punch the blue down here. Now what I'm doing is I'm able to select this little tool over here, the saturation tool, and click it on a color, and I can ramp it up or ramp it down by scrolling the wheel. So that's how I got there. Then what I can do is I can come over here to the tone curve, do the same thing. So I'm going to bring down my darkness just a little bit. There we go. Bring, out the, bring the highlights down just a tad so his skin looks a little more natural. Here's what I'm going to do. That. I'm gonna, okay, saturation, no. That was a bad one. I think I may have moved it a little bit too far. So contrast it here. A little too much down there. There we go. Bring the highlights down. Bring some of the shadows back in. Maybe even soften this up just a tad. It was a little too harsh. There we go. Let me bring back some of the purple out of his face because it's a little too much. There we go. And then play with the shadows. Bring the shadows down a little bit here. Darken everything up. His shirt being especially... Uh, it was a black shirt with these rhinestones or shiny, I don't know, shiny bits of a shirt. That's the Austin City Limits. Really, really cool shirt. Made some for some great lighting and shine. But also happened to turn uh, almost more like a blue in most light. So it was very, very odd and not easy to play with. So punch that color up there. And yes, you can see obviously there's some grain and there's a lot of noise and grain. I can come down here and smooth this out just a little bit. But overall, I'm okay with it being green. It's a concert shot. It's like a rock concert shot. So, well, he's playing the piano, so it's not like a rock concert at this point. But, so you see what I'm saying. It's okay to have that kind of uh, noise or anything like that. I personally don't find it a problem. I actually really, really like it here. And I did a few more things, a few more quick edits. A uh, little bit of sharpening. A little bit of a uh, touch-up to his face. And this is where I ended up with something right about there. It's actually, you can see, a little bit lighter than this image I was just editing on. But that's what happens when you go back and do multiple edits. You never know. So, uh, I'm going to do a few more of these. But this ends this photo. So if you like these little quick tips, uh, please like this video. Comment below. Tell me what you want to see next. Tell me what kind of techniques you want me to show. Uh, dodging and burning. How I punch. When do I decide to do uh, black and white versus color, all these things. I'm going to cover a lot more photos, go out through a lot more quick, ticks, quick tips and topics. So just let me know what you want to see. And if you want to check out all my photos, you can go to www.connormacraymedia.com slash RTX hyphen 2016. All right. Thank you very much and have a good one.